Hey, are you looking to level up your fitness game and maybe thinking about adding a supplement to your routine? Well, what if I told you there's one out there that's been put through the ringer in research labs more than any other, yet still holds a few secrets? Yes, I'm talking about creatine. Despite its stellar reputation and immense popularity, there's a whole lot about creatine that folks just don't talk about and some myths that need to be busted. So why does this supplement remain shrouded in mystery? In today's video, we're diving deep and uncovering 12 hidden truths about creatine supplementation that could totally change the game for you. By the the end of this video you'll have all the info you need to decide if creatine is your next big move in your health and fitness journey let's get right into the details and debunk the myths answer the unanswered and get you all geared up with knowledge ready to get the lowdown on creatine number one let's get right to the point you simply can't get enough creatine just from your diet even if you're loading up on meat here's the deal your body makes creatine and also gets some from foods like beef but that only fills up about 60 to 80 percent of your creatine stores to fully saturate these stores and reap the complete benefits of creating like boosted muscle power and faster recovery, you'd need way more than what food can provide. Think about this. You'd have to eat two pounds of beef every day just to get the amount of creatine in one small scoop of supplement powder. So if you're serious about optimizing your fitness performance, supplementing with creatine might just be your best bet. It's a simple step that could really amp up your game. Number two. All right, let's talk brain gains. Did you know that creatine isn't just for boosting muscle power? It turns out this powerhouse supplement is also a brain booster. Just like your muscles, your brain uses phosphocreatin, which helps it operate at its best. Studies have shown that supplementing with just 5 grams of creatine daily can significantly improve your working memory and intelligence scores. That's not all. After just 5 days of taking 8 grams of creatine, people experience less mental fatigue while crunching numbers. But there's more good news. Creatine might also help with mood regulation. Research suggests that it can ease symptoms of anxiety and depression, improve your sleep quality, and overall, just make you feel better. So if you're looking for a supplement that covers both mental and physical performance, creating could be your go-to. Number three, did you know creating can be your secret weapon for fat loss too? Here's the lowdown. A meta-analysis from the Journal of Functional Morphology and Kinesiology revealed some pretty exciting stuff. People who added creatine to their regimen while doing resistance training not only gained more lean body mass, but also shed more fat compared to those who didn't supplement. Here's why it works. Creatine isn't just about giving you that extra push in the gym to lift heavier and work out longer, which by the way does help burn more calories. It also directly kicks your fat metabolism into high gear. Creatine boosts mitochondrial ATP production in your fat tissues, which cranks up your metabolic rate, particularly in subcutaneous and brown fat. This means your body becomes more efficient at energy expenditure, turning you into a fat-burning machine. So, if you're looking to trim down and tone up, consider creatine for that double whammy of muscle gain and fat loss. Number four, so let's bust a big myth about creatine today, water retention. A lot of people shy away from creatine because they're worried about looking bloated or watery. But here's the real scoop. The water retention from creatine isn't what you think. Creatine pulls water into your muscle cells, not just anywhere under your skin. It does this through a sodium-dependent process that actually helps your muscles maintain balance and osmolality inside the cells. What does this mean for you? Well, this internal muscle hydration is fantastic for your gains. It promotes gene expression in your muscles that's super conducive to growth. In short, while yes, creatine does cause your muscles to retain more water, it's all about making them appear fuller and more pumped, not bloated or watery. So if you're looking to add some serious size and have muscles that look more defined, don't let the fear of water retention hold you back from using creatine. Number five, now guess what? Creatine is not just about boosting your gains, it's got some serious health perks too. Recent studies are showing that creatine packs a powerful punch with anti-inflammatory and antioxidant properties. A systematic review highlighted that creatine can actually help reduce inflammation and ward off the breakdown of proteins in your body. It might even slow down the progression of cancerous tumors. Another eye-opener from the Journal of Free Radical Biology and Medicine found that creatine can mop up free radicals, boosting your cells' antioxidant defenses. This means creatine isn't just good for your muscles, it's also a guardian for your cells, protecting against oxidative stress and inflammation. Number six, creatine also appears to have significant benefits for bone health. Research focusing on postmenopausal women demonstrated that creatine supplementation could increase bone mineral density by up to 3%. A similar study in 2005 found increased bone density in older men who supplemented with creatine. While the exact mechanisms remain unclear, it's believed that the improvement in bone health is linked to creatine's ability to enhance muscle strength, which in turn supports and strengthens the skeletal structure. Number seven, creatine has been recognized for its neuroprotective properties, especially as a potential therapeutic intervention for neurological disorders such as Huntington's, Parkinson's, Alzheimer's disease, and a it's also suggested
tested to help prevent long-term memory loss and strokes. In studies like one conducted on mice with Huntington's disease, creating supplementation led to improved motor performance, reduced neuron atrophy, fewer Huntington protein aggregates, and even increased survival rates. These neuroprotective effects are thought to be linked to creatine's ability to boost phosphocreatine levels in the brain, improving energy metabolism, and reducing oxidative stress in neurons, extending benefits from the brain and spinal cord to the peripheral nervous system. Number eight, contrary to popular belief, creatine does not cause hair loss. This misconception largely originates from a 2009 study that noted an increase in DHT levels, a hormone associated with male pattern baldness after creatine use. However, a more recent and comprehensive systematic review by the Journal of the International Society of Sports Nutrition has effectively debunked this myth. This extensive review analyzed 12 studies on the effects of creatine on testosterone levels and found that only two showed any change both of which were physiologically insignificant. Moreover, five of these studies reported no changes in the levels of free testosterone, a precursor to DHT, among participants, further supporting the lack of a link between creatine supplementation and hair loss. Number nine, creatine has been confirmed as completely safe for long-term use. The International Society of Sports Nutrition, in their 2017 position stand, endorsed creatine as a safe and effective supplement across various demographics, including men, women, children, and the elderly. This endorsement is backed by extensive research, including one of the most thorough studies which monitored 54 clinical health markers over nearly two years of creatine supplementation, finding no adverse effects. Additionally, there is no evidence to suggest that creatine causes harm to the liver or kidneys in healthy individuals. While those with pre-existing conditions should consult a doctor, fears about creatine causing dehydration or cramps are also unfounded. In fact, studies have shown that creatine can enhance exercise performance in hot environments without affecting the body's heat regulation. Furthermore, it does not increase the incidence of injury or cramping even in rigorous conditions like college football. With consistent research affirming its safety, creatine stands out as a reliable supplement for long-term health and fitness goals. Number 10, creatine loading is not a must for achieving its benefits. In a study by Holtman and colleagues, it was shown that participants reached similar levels of muscular creatine accumulation, whether they consumed 3 grams per day over 28 days or went with a more intensive 20 grams per day for just 6 days. The primary difference was simply how quickly their creatine stores were saturated. For those looking to boost their creatine levels faster, you can opt for a loading phase of 20 to 25 grams per day for about a week, followed by a maintenance dose of 5 grams daily. However, be mindful that higher doses can lead to stomach discomfort. To minimize this, you could spread the daily intake across meals, taking 4 to 5 grams of creatine with each meal if you eat about 5 times a day. Number 11. According to research published in the Journal of Strength and Conditioning Research, about 25% of people are considered creatine non responsive these individuals naturally have higher creatine stores and as a result don't see the same performance enhancements from supplementation as others might. If you're curious whether creatine will benefit you, the best way to find out is simply to try it. Remember, it can take two to three weeks for creatine to fully saturate your muscles and show its effects. Number 12. Women might not reap the same physical performance benefits from creatine supplementation as men, primarily because they naturally have higher concentrations of intramuscular creatine. Studies like one from the Journal of Medicine and Science and Sports and Exercise have shown that females often experience less responsiveness to creatine in terms of exercise performance enhancements compared to males. Thus, the overall benefits of creatine supplementation can still be quite valuable for women, even if they differ from those experienced by men. So there you have it. 12 things no one tells you about supplementing with creatine. To sum it up, creatine is safe, effective, and thanks to its affordability, it's a great option for anyone looking to boost their health and performance. If you found some useful information, go ahead and hit that like button. Stay flexing and glowing and have a good one.